In the UK, coal-fired power stations still provide the bulk of our energy. These days, about 70% of the coal we use is imported, much of it from Eastern Europe. The coal arrives here at the mouth of the Humber in the form of rough dust. And on a windy day, this can pose a very real hazard. It's the job of Council Officer Danny Fox to keep an eye on proceedings. And with dust like this, a weather eye. As you can see, we've got uh, a hole here full of um, power station coal, fairly fine, 0 to 50 millimetres. We need to check whether or not there's any dust coming off it and whether or not we need to put any water in the hold uh, to keep the coal dust down. A Russian container ship is unloading 25,000 tonnes of coal dust. Everything seems to be in order, no problems. Apart from, we just have got some very dusty coal gone in there. Just let me have a look. You on the radio to it? Yeah. Can you get some water? Yeah. On the hopper. The worst thing that can happen is the wind's in the wrong direction and the town of Immingham gets covered in black coal dust. And that's what we're striving to avoid at all costs. Danny's job isn't over till the hold is completely free of coal dust. Once the cargo's been, the bulk of the cargo's been removed, then men have to go down there and sweep up the very last dregs that are in there, because this is a general cargo vessel. So its next cargo may not be coal, it could be wheat, it could be any bulk cargo, iron ore, so that the vessel has to be cleaned before it leaves the uh, port. It's very important the dust isn't blown by the wind. Danny has reason to be pleased. Thank you very much, everything's absolutely fine, and we'll see you next time, have a good trip. You're welcome. Okay. See you, bye. Dost for Danny.